happen and we, s we were able also to follow the non hydrolytic kinetics. So we saw that compared with the NEAT system, inorganic uh, rich system alone without lactide, and in the lactide that the non hydrolytic salt gel reaction occurs, so it works, but it works uh, slowly, or slower than uh, with the NEAT system due to the dilution effect in within the lactide which act as a kind of solvent. And uh, that was possible to generate in situ within the lactide without any production of alcohol and water, inorganic rich nanophase, and then polymerize the system in order to get the final nanocomposite PLA plus nanoparticles uh, based on, on silicon. So different uh, different pictures, uh, just to conclude, that the PLA with the preform uh, silica, in which of course we can have uh, agglomerate, but if we are able, as I, as I said, to generate, uh, to avoid uh, and screen some particle-particle uh, -particle interaction, quite nice uh, morphologies. In that case here you, we have the PLA, in which we uh, condense or precursors, uh, which is a polydeoxy silane. So again, that's a nice way to generate in situ a poly into a polymer nanoparticles of, of silica, or silicon-rich particle within, so that's a very efficient way also, avoiding a, a part of the problem of viscosity, because in that case the viscosity is quite high, remember, PLA, and uh, preform silica, that's a high viscosity, even forming some, uh, uh, some, uh, some gel from the beginning, as in the pure lactide. And uh, for uh, this uh, route could be efficient to avoid the uh, filling with, uh, the, with silica and generate in situ. With L-lactide, uh, that's nice, but we can we are not able always to disperse well disperse the uh, silica within the lactide, which polymerizes in order to form PLA. And the lactide TOS, we have the kind of uh, I missed the, the the right picture with non hydrolytic, but uh, with the salt gels chemistry, we can have nice uh, well dispersed particle within the PLA. And uh, if we may now use the functionalization of uh, whatever the, the system, so functionalization could be used both on the neat uh, fume silica from the beginning or using a, a coupling agent in the, in the case in which we are doing some uh, chemistry, <coughs> soldier chemistry, or using a silica on which we have a silane which is hydroxy terminated we can generate nice well dispersed morphologies and those uh, those uh, side uh, could be a very efficient way to design morphologies so i will not read the conclusion but uh, the conclusion are that uh, it's possible uh, of course to use the uh, different routes depending on what you want to do and especially the interesting uh, thing could be to use the salt gel chemistry which avoids a lot of problems of processing by generating in situ the nanoparticles and even to combine salt gel chemistry with the polymerization that was one of the example, ring opening polymerization but there are a lot of other chemistries which can be combined with salt gel uh, chemistries of course and non hydrolytic is a very interesting uh, route, but which needs to be more uh, investigated. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. I think you showed very nicely that uh, you can generate a lot of different morphologies. So I'm sure there are some questions. <coughs> I didn't understand your question. No. Do, you, do you have at this stage some preliminary information on the effect of the silica on processability and on physical and mechanical properties? Yeah. You have shown the Yeah. Ah, you mean some properties of those? Well, oh. the, uh, no, I, I is well known as the uh, poly very nice polymers that it has some uh, efficiency. Yep. And maybe with the silica, it's possible to, to improve 
Uh, yeah, that what was is your experience? Like, okay, that was the objective of this work, which was not focused on properties, but we can say that the mechanical properties, of course, with fume silica, uh, is interesting. So we, we get interesting properties. We are we have some work actually. Uh, also uh, on uh, looking to the degradation of the system in which we generate or put some silica in. An interesting thing, I'll skip completely that part, is crystallization, because you know that PLA, the, one of the problems of PLA to, to get interesting properties for, uh, ap for applica industrial application is, is a very slow crystallization process. And we are not able to explain why, but with the non-hydrolytic uh, route, with the, the morphologies we generate, we found a very fast crystallization process, which means that uh, we can expect interesting properties at the end, because of course the PLA will be more crystalline but, than the neat metrics. So the, this work was not focused on the properties, but. Uh, we, we have some, of course, in, in increase of the modulus and E prime uh, before, but, but uh, also after the, the, the glass transition region. Huh? Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, Pastor. A very interesting presentation. As you know, one of the problems of polylactic uh, acid is the thermal sensibility. So I am. Uh, could you explain how it is possible to control during the polymerization by processing of uh, lactide the temperature or to avoid the uh, reversible thermal degradation of the polymer that is formed during the polymerization process? Could you explain something? We, 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 do, uh, we do things which are not well explained, but we found sometimes uh, very interesting properties as uh, some. Uh, so the, the PLA, if we go through the extrusion, for example, could be degraded. So the molar mass decrease. But sometimes by combining with the soil gel chemistry with, with the right functionalities of the coupling agent, I mean the, 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 the organo-functional group onto the alkoxy silane, you can graft your, your inorganic phase, which is uh, nano, but also multifunctional, with the chain ends generated from the degradation of PLA. And uh, you can get at the end crusting material. So avoiding the uh, full degradation of the PLA by changing, of course, completely the nature of the polymer, but uh, avoiding this problem of molar mass by yeah. crusting the PLA. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I think we, we have to move on now. Is there was, question or okay, question. maybe just, yeah, there are two more, but anyway, okay, short, short question maybe, yeah? yeah. I will go. And I'm thinking only in the uh, using of destruction as a reaction.